Hello, are you confused about how to access your blue ribbons on Study Island? Well, this video is really going to help clarify that for you. Everybody should have a class titled All and then your grade level, Grade. It might say 6th, 7th, or 8th grade right here. Everybody has access to this course. Go ahead and click on this plus sign over here and you'll see a whole menu drop down. The custom reading tests are right here, and those should have been answered um, at the beginning of school. If you haven't taken these tests, go ahead and do so now. But right down here, you'll see the 7.1 ELA, or it might say 8.1 or 6.1, and then you also have a math section. Go ahead and click on either of these, and it'll bring up either four or five different lessons. These are the blue ribbons that need to be completed. Go ahead and click on the title, and it'll bring up a screen that gives you three options, practice mode, printable worksheet, or game mode. You're welcome to print off a worksheet to practice the concept, or you're welcome to play um, some games on there. But either way, go ahead and at the end of practicing or anything like that, click on practice mode and select 10 questions, and then hit next. And it takes you right to the test, and the answers. You simply click on your answer and then it'll take you to next and that's all you do for the blue ribbon. I'll go through it one more time to make sure you guys got it. The grade level, hit the plus sign, come down to ELA and math and click on the title, select a lesson. You're going to want to select practice mode only 10 questions and click next. When you've passed these assignments, a blue ribbon will appear next to the lesson name. That's how you know you've completed the blue ribbon. You can also know you've done it when right up here it'll show one out of five, two out of five, and so on, up to five out of five. You wanna see everything completed. I hope this helped clarify how to complete these blue ribbons in Study Island. If you still have questions, go ahead and contact your homeroom or content teacher, and we'd love to help you uh, figure it all out. Thanks for watching.